Ever since we first saw the teaser, there's been somewhat of a buzz in the Halo community regarding this particular shot. Yes, the marines look freaking badass, but there's something else keen eyes were able to pick up in this scene. The battle rifles. What about the battle rifles? Well, they look a bit different. They're not a complete overhaul, but the color scheme and the scope indicate that this battle rifle is a combination of the classic H2 BR and the Halo 5 BR. So in the spirit of Halo Infinite, I thought I'd take some of the most iconic weapons in Halo and redesign them. Okay, I just want a total of 20 seconds before I begin to tell you- DON'T SKIP AHEAD, I CAN SEE YOUR FINGER ON THE ARROW KEY. Alright, so I just want you to click that red button over there. Yeah, that one. I've been doing YouTube for two years and I honestly find doing this really fun. So I'd appreciate a small audience. Alright, I said 20 seconds, so that's it. On with the video now. So I think we should begin with the one we've already seen, the battle rifle. So here's where I think we should start, with the Sentinel BR from Halo 5. Since I think it's the one that looks most like an updated version of the H2BR. So first things first, make that shit black. It should have never been silver. What were you thinking 343? Okay, so now that it's black, I think the ammo counter and the scope should be blue. It's a very iconic color combination and it makes the BR look much more Halo-esque. So, there it is, the Dream BR. At least I think so. You can see that how a simple thing like the color scheme goes a long way with making a weapon look good. So I'm pretty happy with that. So now let's move on to the Snoop Rifle. Now in my opinion, the Halo 2 Anniversary Sniper Rifle looks damn near perfect. Much better than the Halo 5 Sniper Rifle. But our aim today is to combine the art styles. So we're gonna start with the Halo 5 Rifle. And I'm gonna take the screen and make it as big as it deserves to be. I got rid of the scope since it feels kind of redundant when you have a huge screen in front of you. So now it kind of looks naked if that makes any sense. So what I did next was I ripped the scope of the Halo Reach sniper rifle and plugged the wiser thing onto our new snoop. I really like what I ended up with but I think it looks kind of rough. So maybe some of you who are more professional with photoshop can make this design better. And now we're moving to my personal favorite weapon in Halo, the DMR. Now one thing I'll say, I'm not a fan of the Halo Reach DMR, it looks a bit peculiar. The Halo 4 DMR is easily my favorite and the Halo 5 DMR would have been perfect if they didn't get rid of the ammo counter and kept the green scope, like peeps at 343, the battle rifle is supposed to be black and blue, not the DMR goddammit. Lucky for us, I'm here to fix it. I'm gonna start with the Halo 5 DMR because as I said, I do not like the Reach DMR and what I'm gonna do is take the ammo counter from the Halo 4 DMR and put it in here. And now, after a bit of cleaning up, it looks at least twice as good as it used to be. And now I'm just gonna make the scope green because how, that's how it should be. P.S. Wouldn't it be cool if the DMR gave us night vision so the green scope actually serves a purpose? I don't know, let me know in the comments. So uh, here's the result. Probably my favorite so far, so now let's move on to the Magnum. So to start, I'm using the Halo 4 Magnum. Why? Because it's the last Magnum that used the iconic Halo CE design. But it needs some tinkering, mostly at the butt of the gun. From Halo CE to Halo Reach, the Magnum had these cool LEDs at the back, which for some reason they got rid of in Halo 4. So I think that the only thing that needs to be changed here is adding back the LEDs. I think that looks pretty good, so now let's move on to the Assault Rifle. Now I really like the Halo 5 Assault Rifle, but there are some things that I'm not a fan of. Firstly, the lines engraved on the side of the weapon in Halo 3 were gotten rid of in the Halo 5 Assault Rifle. So what I did was I just added them back in. The second problem is it shares the same problem as the Battle Rifle, the color scheme. So all I did was adjust the color of the weapon mainly got rid of the olive accents and made it a bit darker because the olive accents they just ruined the look of the weapon. And there we are, here's the final piece. The shotgun, I tried to think around with it but uh, never really got something that I was satisfied with. So all I did was I just added in the LEDs but I think what should be done is we should just get rid of the new one and uh, bring back the Halo Reach uh, shotgun because that looks perfect. Now after these redesigns, there's the problem as to how these changes will be canonically explained. Well, as for the assault rifle and the battle rifle, it's as simple as saying that it's a small revision 
or version 2.0 of the same model. For the sniper rifle and the DMR, they could say it's just a scope change. The Magnum and the shotgun could be stated as modified version of the same weapon or again version 2. So there's all of my redesigns guys. I hope you liked them, I had fun making them and hopefully you had too. Be sure to subscribe because it's summer holidays and I'll be pumping out more Halo videos soon. That's all I have to say so stay mature.